getting high ping and lag spikes on Roblox? We have you covered. Here are 5 ways you can fix it. Before we move forward, do us a favor by subscribing to our channel and liking this video. It's free and helps us a lot. We do tons of research trying to find the working solutions for you. This way, you can stay connected with us and get quick help with your future tech issues. Now, let's get started. Before we start the solutions, you need to first enable the performance stats on Roblox. This way, you can see the ping you are getting and also the CPU and GPU usage. Open Roblox and start any game. Press Escape and click on Settings. Turn on the performance stats. Once that's done, let's head to the solutions. Method 1 The first thing you need to do is disable any VPN you are using. Playing the game while being connected to any VPN can lead to a high ping and lag spikes. Press the Windows plus I keys to open settings. Click on Network and Internet and select the VPN option. Turn off all the toggles. Method 2 The next thing you can do is run the internet troubleshooter. Open settings again and click on system. Select troubleshoot and then click on other troubleshooters. Run the internet connections troubleshooter and follow the on-screen instructions. Method 3 The next thing you can try is flushing the DNS and resetting WinSock. Type command prompt in the search bar and run it as administrator. Type ipconfig space forward slash flush DNS and press enter. Next, type net sh WinSock reset and press enter. We have provided the commands in the description of this video so you can simply copy paste from there. Restart your PC once the commands finish running. Don't have a solution so far? After the video ends, join our Facebook group where our experts help users just like you solve tech issues every day. Join the group from the link in the description or the pinned comment and ask for help. We promise to help you out. Method 4 The next thing you can do is Try changing the DNS. Changing the DNS has fixed this issue for many players and should also help you. Press the Windows plus R keys to open Run. Type ncpa.cpl and press Enter. Right click on the network adapter you are using for the internet connection and select Properties. Double click on the Internet Protocol version 4 option. Select Use the following DNS server addresses. First, Enter. 8.8.8.8 .8 in the preferred DNS server and 8.8.4.4 .4 in the alternated DNS server section, which is Google's public DNS. Click on OK to save the changes. Method 5 The next thing you need to do is make sure no other application is using the network and dividing the bandwidth. This includes any download or upload happening in the background. An easy way to figure it out is using the resource monitor. Type resource monitor in the Windows search bar and select the top result. Click on the network tab and expand the processes with network activity section. Wait for a few seconds for the processes to appear. Here you will be able to see which process is hogging your internet speed. If it is an unnecessary process, then simply right click on it and select the end process option. So that's it. Subscribe to our channel and get quicker solution to all your tech issues. Join our Facebook group and you will get direct help on everything tech. Leave a comment and help others know.
with solution solve your problem thanks for watching and always remember that we are here to help you out